And then in relation to South Africa, God gave me a message and he said, we must pray against the racist incidents. Because in a vision, when I was in the city for South Africa, uh, I realized that uh, I saw myself in a vision, watching a television, a South African news channel, and I was seeing a news report about racism, racist acts. So we must pray against acts of racism. They can inflame feelings and cause a lot of people to damage a lot of property, demonstrating the streets. The enemy is planning just a mishap somewhere. There are people who are racist. I won't say, but I saw everything in a vision. The, the people or persons who perpetrated this act of racism and the victims, I saw them in a vision. But the Holy Spirit is saying I must not spell out what, what I actually saw. I must just deliver the message and say we must pray against the acts of racism in South Africa. Look at your neighbor and say pray against the acts of racism in South Africa. Yes, these acts of racism uh, that I'm talking about, they may be very vicious. I'm not talking about um, someone insulting another person, saying papoon or whatever. I'm not talking about insults. I am talking about an abusive act, which can cause many people to demonstrate, because I saw many people demonstrating in the streets, in a certain place in South Africa, or in certain places in South Africa, because of these acts of racism. So the Holy Spirit is saying, in the spirit of Ubuntu, in the spirit of us being all descendants of Adam, all of us having been created by one God, we must pray against acts of racism. Say pray against acts of racism. Still in relation to South Africa, I saw that uh, uh, from around July, August, these people are planning to deport a lot of foreigners, especially Zimbabweans. That's what God was showing me. He was showing me buses. I mean, think, mot I mean, modes of transport which look like lorries or buses. I couldn't make out clearly what I was seeing in a vision. But uh, there were many of these vehicles that were transporting people who were being deported. So we must pray against the deportations. Because uh, if these deportations were to okay, there would be a serious upset of crime this side. But uh, I see that these people are planning to deport a lot of foreigners in South Africa. I'm talking about South Africa. Look at your neighbor and say he is talking about South Africa. Yes. It's not only South Africa where I saw in relation this kind of situation. Even Botswana as well. But especially South Africa where we've got hundreds of thousands of Zimbabweans who are working and resident there.